This is Will Perry III with Multimedia News and today we are in the Pleasant Grove area in our community and we're going to do a little bit of investigative reporting today. We've been getting reports about Bishop J. Lee Slater and this infamous or famous <laughs> handshake and it's much like having your hand put into a vice and just squeezed until every bone cracks. So we been hearing reports, even on radio shows. Ricky Smiley has made mention of it. There it is. Hey, we love you, Pastor Slater. Huh? We love you. We love y'all too, man. Y'all, God bless you, and I appreciate y'all. What, what's the name? Let everybody know where your church at. Name your church right quick. Man, New Millennium Bible Fellowship Praise Center, 9026 Elam Road. Hey, man, you can hook up on with us and on Facebook at the letter J. Lee Slater, amen. There it is. Hey, love you, Pastor Slater. Love you, man. God bless you. God bless you, Reverend Slater. Didn't Reverend Slater have big hands or something? What you say? Yeah, he used to shake hands. He used to shake hands real hard. All right, yeah. Hey, you still be breaking kids' hands when you shake their hands hey, at church? You better come with it. <laughs> 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 hey, Pastor Slater, you got some big hands. Hey, Pastor Slater, be shaking hands so hard. <laughs> What like? Oh, like your blood for them. Like to hug the hell out of folks. <laughs> he said he learned to hug the hell out of folks. That's right. So we're just going to find out for ourselves what's really going on. This is New Millennium Bible Fellowship Praise Center, and I'm Will Perry the Third with Multimedia News. We're here today with Bishop J. Lee Slater. How you doing today, Bishop? I'm doing fine, Minister Will. How are you right. doing, uh, sir? Wonderful, wonderful. Good. We have heard some great things about New Millennium Bible Fellowship Praise Center, and yes. we've heard some wonderful things about you and First Lady. Oh. And uh, but we've actually been getting some interesting reports about this famous, or shall we say, infamous <laughs> handshake of yours. Oh, well, uh, yeah. <laughs> it is reported that you have one of the most devastating, crushing handshakes that there is. <laughs> oh, well, Brother Will, don't believe the hype always. You know, mm -hmm. we've been, you know, we try to shake hands moderately and we try to be, you know, at the same time be uh, very sure about what we're doing and making sure we give a nice, firm agreement. <laughs> so it sounds like you're in a little bit of denial about this handshake, thing, Bishop. So I'd like to show you something. Watch this. <laughs> firm handshake. I can't help they went about, you know. <laughs> you know, I, I mean, come on, man. What you think? You know, aren't you supposed to give a good firm handshake or what? Yes, you know? sir, Bishop. You know, I, I know y'all going to do this. You know? <laughs> no. So, personally, though, in your own person, like doing, you know, let's say job interviews or, you know, uh, meetings where you happen to uh, uh, meeting a lot of people and you're doing a lot of handshakes and down at the city and things like that. Have you ever had any adverse reactions <laughs> to your handshakes? <laughs> well, I've had a few, you know, and it's unfortunate some people have their wedding bands on and different <laughs> things like this, and I give them a firm handshake. And say, ah! 
you know, I say, oh, I'm sorry, I didn't mean to do, you know, you're all right, man, you're all right, but, you know, the thing about it is, if, if they grip my hand right, and as I grip their hand right, everything be all right, you know, you just give them. Oh, so there's an actual technique to this thing. Okay. Yeah, that's a technique to everything, you know. <laughs> okay, likewise, mom taught me the same thing, shake a person's hand firm, look him in the eye, and, uh, you Absolutely. Know, that, that asserts uh, not only your manhood, but uh, and also, you know, uh, uh, elicits respect. Amen. Amen. And, that, and that's one of the things, that's the important thing of eliciting respect, you know, to the person, especially young people, you know, those of you who are looking for jobs and so on and so forth, you know, make sure you give them a good firm hand. <laughs> now, we've had some other reports now dude, oh. that you also not only have this crushing handshake, but that you actually hug the hell out of people. <laughs> <laughs> well, I mean, you know, I've been known as a hugger, too. Okay. I've been known as a hugger, especially when I was coming up as a young person, and, and I just hugged somebody. I'm never going to stop this. Hug, 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 hug. Oh, I love this. Hug, hug, hug. That a lot of people are really helped by a hug, you know. As a matter of fact, we, we got a, a ministry in our new partner's orientation when they come into church. It's called Hugs. Right. Helping unlock the grips of Satan. All right. You know, <laughs> and that's, you know, hugging those people, at least three to four hugs, you know, throughout the worship. Okay. You know, so you never know what people are dealing with when they're coming into in the church. They yeah. might have had hell at their home, might have had hell on their job, might have had hell with the children, husband and wife at odds with one another. Mm -hmm. And when they come in to worship, they come in with this heaviness on them, you know, this hell yeah. in them. And then <laughs> when we hug them, you know, it helps. Hug the hell out of them, you know. Right. More people right. come up, help hug, hug them, you know. <laughs> hug the hell out. I don't mean hugging them strong, just hugging them. Period. All and right. so we hug the hell out of them, literally, because <laughs> they begin to feel the love and feel the joy, you know. And so that's what that's all about. So, is there anything else, Bishop, that uh, you like to share with us as far as <laughs> the history of this? Handshake, this, this holy handshake. <laughs> well, actually, uh, yes, I can, Minister Will. You know, I mean, when we were coming up younger, you know, we was all into the Bruce Lee. You know, all that time back in the 70s, Saturday, I guess I'm telling Saturday my age. Morning, <laughs> yes, sir. You know, and, uh, you know, we used to, you know, see who, you know, playing that manly stuff, you know, mm -hmm. all that stuff, them, that testosterone and all that stuff, turning around. We, I used to actually break sticks with my hand, you know, we mop handles and, oh, wow. you know, and, and then uh, literally chopped the two by four. You know, and, and then got to bricks, you know, and stuff. <laughs> I mean... Oh, don't hit back. It was just fun, you know, I never broke the brick, you know, but I did break it two by four, you know, uh -huh. and, uh, you know, rotten one. <laughs> but, I mean, it was it was just showing that machoism, you know, and, and staying in the karate thing, the karate era, you know, so I broke the sticks, you know, and stuff like that. You know, we did all that stuff, you know, yeah. see, we punch you in the stomach and see if you can take the lick and all that stuff. And then, I, and then it was my turn. <laughs> and so, but that's basically it, you know. I have a lot of things I can share with, but some things is off camera. <laughs> all right. Amen. 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 This has been a very enlightening time. Yes, sir. We, we know you're a busy man. You have a lot on your plate, so we're not going to take much time. And actually, we just want to thank you for you know spending this time with us. And hopefully, well, you'll allow us to come back as things get better and greater, and we'll do a follow-up. Amen. So sure Amen. Appreciate your time. Oh, oh. Once again, we are here with Multimedia News. I am Minister Will Perry III, and we are with our very own executive pastor, our First Lady, Donna Gail Slater. Hello. Now, First Lady. Yes, sir. We just finished talking to Bishop about this uh, infamous handshake of his, and he was uh, in a bit of denial, so we really want your take on the whole thing. What have you experienced well, or noticed throughout the years with this uh, crushing handshake of his. Well, I have to say that 
I've heard that people are not very pleased with his handshakes or should I not say pleased with his handshake but they are taken aback because he does have a very strong handshake but I must say myself that having knowing him 26 years now uh, that I like his handshakes <laughs> I like his hands matter of fact that's some of the thing that was one of the things that drew me to him when we were dating hi honey but um, I, I like his handshakes and his handshakes are real gentle Although I do have to twist my rings around when we hold hands and pray. I have to make sure that, or, or yeah, that does hurt. But I still love you. <laughs> well, thank you again, First Lady, for your time. This You're is welcome. Will Perry the Third Multimedia News, and we will see you later.